Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuhu. I am Nurain Kasanova Kusain by Stuwe, a second reporter from Group 10. So now I am no going to discuss the continuation of our topic, which is Shah Wali Allah. Shah Wali Allah was born on 1702-03 at Delhi, India and died on 1762 at the same place where he was born. He is an Indian theologian and promulgator of modern Islamic thought first attempted to resist Islamic theology in the light of modern changes. Wali Allah received a traditional Islamic education from his father and said to have memorized the Quran at the age of seven. In 1732, he made a pilgrimage to Mecca and he then remained in the Hejaz, now in Saudi Arabia, to study religion with eminent theologians. He reached adulthood at the time of disillusionment following the death of 1707 of Aurangzeb, the last Mughal emperor of India. Because large areas of the empire had been lost to Hindu and Sikh rulers of the Deccan and the Punjab, Indian Muslim had to accept the role of the non-Muslim. This challenge occupied Wali Allah's adult life. What did Shah Wali Allah do? Shah Wali Allah was one of the most important religious reformers of subcontinent. There are other reformers as well as, however, Shah Wali Allah is the most prominent amongst them. He not only tried to bring Muslims closer to their religion, but he had a complete chalk out plan for the restoration of the power in India, which means Si Shah Wali Allah ay isa sa mga pinakamahalagang tao na bumago, o bumago upang ang relihiyong Islam ay mas lalo pang tumibay at mahalin ng mga taong Muslim lalo na sa India. He made a plan and effort to become Indian Muslim are more powerful. That's all. Shukran and wassalam.